some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we find ourselves in Lancaster, Pennsylvania, where we find a frauditor who thinks he knows everything. Well, what else is new? Because generally, frauditors suffer from a great deal of the Dunning-Kruger effect. In other words, they're so stupid they don't know how stupid they truly are. So, let's sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Good morning, everyone. First Capital Transparency coming to you on this bone-chilling December morning in downtown Lancaster, Pennsylvania, a beautiful historic town. Today, I will be visiting the Lancaster Free Public Library and something that is really just heartbreaking. If I can zoom in, that poor American flag, it's not quite ripped to shreds, but it's stuck in the tree branches. I never saw tree branches that are overtaking a flagpole. We might have to say something about that. I will have to agree with you on this one. I think that it should be disposed of properly and replaced with a new flag, which there are proper disposal methods and ceremonies that you can go through to do so. Oh my goodness, frauditor, this is such riveting content that I forgot to stay awake. Okay, okay, sir, you, you can't do that in here. Shh. No, you're going to have to turn that off. Yeah. Then you're going to have to leave. Shh. You're required to leave. If you don't walk out, you're going to have to call the police. There's no filming. There's no filming. In here. You're going to have to leave. You're going to have to leave. You're going to have to leave, sir. Why do you have to leave? It's for, Michael, people, call it's for people's privacy. You're not allowed to show people in a library. It's for people's privacy. Do you know that this is public? Yeah, it's, you, it's open to the public. I'm well aware of that, yes. And there's no expectation of privacy in public. You're just trying to get a rise out of people. I'm going to call the police. Whatever. You do what you have to do. I'm doing a story here, so please don't un interrupt. Who is he? He's an asshole, sir. I know that. What's his name? That is his name, sir. Asshole. Major asshole. Hey man, how are you? I'm doing good. Good. What's going on? I don't know. You'll have to ask the guy over there with the Santa hat. Okay. They've asked I, you to leave, I heard. So. Oh, they asked me to stop recording. Okay. So I guess they're asking you to leave now, too. So. Can we just but, step outside and we'll talk there? I, I'd rather stay in here, like, where it's warmer, like, in, maybe in a, a corner or something. Okay. So they don't want you to actually be here, so they want you to leave. Right, but uh, did I do something wrong? They just don't want you to be here. Yeah, but I did, did I do something wrong? Well, how about we start with getting your license? I, I, I don't have any ID on me. You don't have any ID? No. So let's step outside and we can talk Case about Case and uh, Valvadere. Valverde. Uh, Val, Val, Valverde, sorry about that. So let's stay outside. They can go walk outside and we'll talk out there. The problem with a lot of these frauditors is that they don't seem to understand that any business can refuse service at any time and they can ask you to leave and they can trespass you even if you haven't committed a crime. I mean, I don't know if it's a mental deficiency or if they're just trying to appeal to the stupidity of their audience. But either way, they're always wrong about it. I, I'd rather stay in here. Right, but that's not what they want. So. But what about what I want? They're infringing on my rights in here. Okay. Well, they want you to stay on top. Well, I, I want. The reason why I'm staying this is because. Apparently, I'm bothering them, and I don't know if this is going against their policy, but it's right, infringing so on my right. You just said it. You're bothering them, so they want you to leave. But you're law enforcement, right? That's you're not feelings, police. How you doing? 
Officer Alexander, is, is one of you a supervisor? I don't believe so. But no, no. Uh, I'm the senior officer here, so I'll, okay. be, I'll be running the incident, right. okay? So you were asked to leave. Right. I, Are you refusing to, to leave? If I refuse to leave... You're going to be arrested for trespassing. Okay. That's yes. all I need to hear. Okay. So you're leaving? Yep, I am leaving. All right, let's go. That's all I needed to know. All right. Fantastic. So from, here, you, so from here on out, just to make sure I get your name, what's your right. badge number since 83. you... 83. Since uh, you'll be named on the litigations. Thank you very litigations. much. Litigations. Yes. Oh, fantastic. Thank you very much. All right. Yeah. We also need to get your um, uh, ID. Somehow I really doubt that you don't have it because it's necessity to carry one around, especially if you need to get carded at a convenience store or any other place for something that needs to be carded. I, I don't have any ID on me. Oh, that, and that's not a problem at all, sir. Um, and, and can I grab your name then? No, because I'd be an infringement on my Fourth Amendment right. Oh, okay. All right. Well, then, if you're refusing to identify yourself, you're going to come with us. Uh, where okay. you, am I going to be arrested for yes. that? Uh, okay. okay. Well, then under duress. And I appreciate that. The officers are leaving, and I am here. I was just unreleased from detainment and handcuffed, but I'm going to get this officer's business card and we'll get the ball rolling on any litigation. And, and even though I know you're in a hurry, uh, the blue line flag. I know. I support. Don't 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 nope. get me started on it. Okay. Don't hey, get, I'm not going to comment on it. Nope. 18 U.S. Code 700. Uh, yeah, I, I I know. Okay, so we have a moron here who refused ID. So they cuffed and detained him until they found out who he was, and now he's going to do a frivolous lawsuit. Oh, how frauderish you are! And now he's going to bitch about the blue light flag. What a crock. Okay, We're going to fight. But, uh, you, man, you're going to be surprised about how much we agree on. All yep. right? You'd be really surprised. What happened here today, we'll, we'll agree to disagree. Well, that that's right. Yeah. We will agree to disagree because I feel uh, it doesn't matter how I feel. So thank All you, right? Steve. So, yeah, you can call me Steve. So that's me on the front. The incident number, can you read that? Uh, yes, I, I can read that. Okay. Um... That's the incident number. For okay. Us. Okay. Okay. Thank Is there you. Anything else I can do for you? No. Thomas? Just be safe out there. Yeah, you too, I, I do right. appreciate you. Do all right. You. Thank you. You know, I wonder sometimes if these idiots get some form of pleasure out of these metallic handcuffs touching their bare skin. Just let your mind wander on that one.